guys, once again, uh, I'm Kamayo Ako. Now I will try to speak it in English for the sake of other uh, viewers. Uh, sorry for not so fluent in English, but I will do my best just to uh, uh, let you understand what I suppose uh, to teach you. Now, uh, previous uh, series, we are discussing about a firm which is here is one so our previous topics we are ended in a last form this one. so as what I told before uh, if you notice here this is a for upload video list look at here Although this uh, form list showing for upload videos, but here you can see uploaded and here for uploaded. This uh, series number six, I just want to show you how to get rid for this one. We will uh, try to uh, separate this uploaded video for upload video. So this one will be done through. Uh, queries by this series I will teach you on how to uh, separate uh, uploaded and for uploaded I will separate into two uh, list form just to emphasize the data which is supposed uploaded only and the other one is for upload in order to separate this one, we need to use a select query. I just want to show you that there are different types of query, select query, make table query, append query, update query, cross tab, and delete, and so on. For now, since we are uh, our topic is about the fundamentals or the basic of the Microsoft Axis. So we will focus on the select query. I just want to show you the uh, simple way to execute our query. Select the table, then go to create, then select query wizard. This uh, will bring you uh, the process select and then click so here you, as you can see there's a simple query cross tab query find duplicates and so on so for now we are only focused on the simple query wizard okay I select simple query wizard then select ok now as here you can see this form the so-called table slash query meaning this one from this is the source so since our before we proceed this uh, wizard we select on tbl records that's why here it's showing table then here is the table name so uh, as you can see be below this is a available fields these fields are resides in this table. This one are the fields. This one. So this this uh, wizard, you can select one time by choosing this one. This one. I just want to emphasize uh, one by one. Yeah, I will uh, return it back here select this one okay now we'll proceed select id then select here then description you can double click or click here again i will return back just double click then get created just double click again then url just double click 
then url date posted okay here date posted no 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 uh, i will return this one we will use this video url this one video url then we'll select status this one is the very important status as you can see here before as we discuss status is either upload or uploaded we need to choose status then select that one or again you can double click then click next this one here you can choose modify then you can modify the query so now uh, we'll use here open query to view information then here you can uh, rename example this one uh, tb no because this we are here in query so we need to uh, change or rename by uh, video list by video list by uploaded so space will put query just to emphasize that this one is we are on query video list uploaded then select finish so as you can see here uploaded and for uploaded still So this is now our query. Close. Receive. Now we will select again TBL records, then go to create, then query wizard, then simple, simple query wizard then go this one double click this one double click description category the created then the posted or depends upon you but as of now i just want to show you how to manage the query video url and status so don't forget status because we are emphasizing here we need to say is uh, segregate the uploaded and for uploaded Okay, click next then next here before we put video we rename video list by uh, video list for because before our query is video list by uploaded then now we need to make query video list for upload wrong spelling wrong sorry for upload so we'll select finish okay now as you can see still right okay, as you can see the status still uploaded it's mixed now we need to separate that one so how we need to put the criteria so will i close then we will start with video list by uploading so as you can see here all here is uploaded uploaded and for upload so meaning we need to get rid for the of this one so here we just to show the list is all uploaded 
So now we will make some criteria. So we will copy this one. Copy. Then we will close our query. Now here we select again. Then right mouse click. Then design view. Now we need to make a design view here. Design view here. Now as you can see here we have one, two, three, four, five, six fields. But here not only six we have a lot. But since this one is just to show uh, the list of uh, uploaded video so that's why we need only this one so no need for this one uploaded so no need for this one that posted uh, upload so we'll remove this one just right click then cut so now here as you can see by selecting run okay. now we will uh, go back to design view either right click then design view or as you can see here just select the home tab then select here view this one automatically we are here in the design view again we are in a select query so why this one as you remember before i copied this uh uploaded this one this is the status now we'll go to design view here the status as you can see here this is the criteria here the sort you can sort by ascending through id or also use here either description or date posting now we are focusing on okay i just want to show you also this one example you need you change your mind and you and you need to put uh, the category because here as you can see there's no category here so if you want to uh, add a category just select this one this one this is that table our source then just double click this one double click then automatically it will came here so if you can if we view our query so now showing the category again we'll now here even you added this category you can hide without uh, cut this one select you uncheck this one so if you uncheck this one if you ra click run or view you can use run or view look there's no category here okay so now we will go to criteria here since this uh, query is for uploaded video we need to put the criteria so if numbers we can write directly 0 1 2 3 4 and so on but if we are using uh, letters character so we need to put double quotes so we need to put double quotes then since I copied the uh, uploaded, just right click, then paste. So this is the one. Then double quote. So guys, see if I select run or view, all list showing only uploaded. Look. So here. So we will save this one. Now we are in uploaded list here as you can see in for upload 
here still showing upload so we need to get rid of this one because we already finish uh, uploaded last so now we are managing a query for for upload videos so we need to copy actually you you can uh, write manually but in order to uh, put the correct status so we need to copy this one for upload copy and now we are here in upload query for upload rather we will close then we will go here right click then design view so we will manage the criteria we'll put the criteria in our status as i told before if if this criteria uh, status about zero one two three you can type directly but since we are uh, putting the status by character so we need to put a uh, double quotes again just put a double quotes from starting then right click here or control v again paste here you can paste or you can use your uh, shortcut case using control v then another put a double quotes okay now we can say that this list is for upload video okay we'll see if this one is uh we achieve this uh our criteria so select run or here view okay good look so this is how the query is so you can put a separate list by using our criteria this one now since before before uh, I need to delete this one because uh, we are using a need to delete this uh, <coughs> criteria we need to create criteria manually so again this is our table source this one as you can see here we have three here one two three but different status two are uploaded and the other one is for upload so we need to separate this one by using uh, our query so now we need to make again query manually so we will go to create then select query design so just select this one now it pop up show table so since our uh, source is table records so we need to select table records either select this one or we can click add or you can also double click this one so we'll select this one double click this one or you can select this one then add look so i will, will remove this one category because we are focusing on here so same uh, selection before uh, through wizard now we'll put manually so again just select this one id uh, let's see okay title then now we'll start with uh, uploaded video so uploaded video meaning we we'll start here date posted then video URL 
just double click then status if you see run here it's showing so we need to get read the same process so since we are uh, managing uh, how to separate this uploaded video so we need to select this one then copy then here showing design view you can see silicone to drop down then design view now we need here status same process yes we need to do put that double click then control v to paste and double click as you can see here uploaded we run lock all uploaded so we need to design view then we need to save save this one is video for uploaded or uploaded video list and again we'll, we'll try again okay now upload it now we need to make another manual for for upload videos so again we need to go to create then query design then select table table record since our uh, tab table source then double click then close then since this one is for upload so we need to put an id this is a unique key then description then we need to category then date created then since we don't we don't have a url yet because this is for upload so we need to put the status now if you select run it's showing all the last of our video so we need to get rid of this uploaded because this uh, qu query are for upload video that's why there's no uh, url yet then we copy this one right click copy then view or here design view then we will put here in criteria double quote then control v then double quote so we will run now we have only one video which not yet uh, uploaded or for for upload okay we need to save then for upload video then okay so this is how to manage our data view using our queries so for now we will uh, end this one then we will continue for ne next series for uh, other uh, criteria on query again thank you for your time and god bless